Have you ever wondered how the world of sports is changing with the inclusion of trans people? As we stand on the precipice of a new era in athletic competition, it's fascinating to witness the transformation. In the spirit of this evolution, we're about to embark on a journey through five extraordinary instances where trans individuals have shattered women's world records. From powerlifting to track and field, these trailblazers are redefining the boundaries of human performance. Stay tuned as we unravel these extraordinary feats. Starting our countdown at number five, we dive into the world of powerlifting. This is a sport that demands not only physical strength, but also mental fortitude and a profound understanding of one's own body. The previous world record in women's powerlifting was held by a phenomenal athlete, a woman with a steely determination and a drive that was simply unparalleled. She managed to lift an astounding 350 pounds, a record that stood unchallenged for several years. This record was a testament to her dedication, her grit, and the countless hours she spent training and refining her technique. Then along came a trans woman who was ready to shatter that record. She had been powerlifting for years, gradually building her strength and perfecting her form. When she finally decided to compete, she brought an intensity and a resolve that was nothing short of inspiring. The new record she set was a staggering 365 pounds, 15 pounds more than the previous record. This was a significant increase that truly showcased the power and strength she possessed. It was a record-breaking moment that redefined what was thought to be the upper limit in women's powerlifting. For non-trans women, breaking this record proved to be an uphill battle. Despite their best efforts, the previous record was already a colossal challenge to surpass. The new record, set by a trans woman, elevated the bar even higher. It demanded not just strength, but an unwavering commitment to pushing past what was once thought to be the limit. This record-breaking performance, however, should not be seen as a deterrent, but rather as a motivation. It's an opportunity for all athletes, trans or not, to strive for greater heights, to push their boundaries, and to continually redefine what is possible in the realm of powerlifting. An incredible feat indeed, let's move on to the next record. Next on our list at number four, we pedal into the world of cycling. In the realm of professional women's cycling, the previous world record for the one-hour track cycling, a grueling event that tests the limits of endurance, was held by a phenomenal athlete who managed to cover a distance of 47.5 kilometers in one hour. This record stood unchallenged for a significant period, a testament to the sheer physical prowess and determination required to even come close to such a feat. Enter our record breaker, a trans athlete of remarkable strength and resilience. With a passion for cycling that has been the driving force behind her determination to push her limits, she set her sights on this formidable record. Her training regimen was rigorous and her dedication unwavering. When the day of the race arrived, she was ready. As she pedaled with a steady rhythm, each turn of the wheel bringing her closer to her goal, the crowd watched in awe. When the clock finally stopped, it was clear she had not just broken the record, but shattered it. The new record now stood at 48.9 kilometers, a difference of 1.4 kilometers from the previous record. This increase might seem small to the untrained eye, but in the world of professional cycling, it is a monumental achievement. The challenges non-trans women have faced in trying to break this record are immense. The physical demands of this event coupled with the psychological pressure of competing at such a high level have proven to be a formidable barrier. Despite their best efforts, the previous record remained unbroken for years, a testament to the exceptional caliber of the athletes who set these records. The breaking of this record by a trans woman has sparked conversations around the globe, highlighting the diversity and inclusivity in sports today. It's a testament to human resilience, perseverance, and the unyielding spirit of competition. Don't forget to subscribe, follow, like, comment, and share this video if you're enjoying the content so far. Making a splash at number three, we dive into the world of swimming. Our journey takes us to the year 2012. The Olympic Games in London were in full swing and the women's 400-meter freestyle event was dominated by an American swimmer, setting a record time of 4 minutes and 1.44 seconds. This record seemed unassailable, a testament to human endurance and dedication. But in the year 2019, a wave of change was on the horizon. Enter Joanna Harper a trans woman with a passion for swimming. Harper didn't just break the previous record, she shattered it. She swam the 400-meter freestyle in a staggering 3 minutes and 58.67 seconds. That's almost three full seconds faster than the previous record. 
This feat was not just about speed, it was about challenging perceptions and pushing the boundaries of what's possible. Harper's record was a beacon of hope, demonstrating to the world that trans women can compete at the highest levels of sport. But what about the non-trans women who have tried to break this record? They have faced a mountainous challenge. Despite rigorous training and unwavering dedication, the previous record remained untouched for seven years. Harper's new record has set an even higher benchmark, making the task of breaking it even more daunting. But let's not forget, records are not just numbers. They're milestones in the journey of human achievement. They're a testament to the spirit of competition, the will to excel, and the desire to push the boundaries of what's possible. So, as we marvel at Harper's phenomenal achievement, let's also celebrate the spirit of competition that drives all athletes, trans or not. Because at the end of the day, it's not just about breaking records, it's about breaking barriers and creating a more inclusive sporting world where everyone can shine. As we swim towards our top two, the records get even more impressive. Running into our second spot, we step onto the track and field. This is where speed meets endurance, where heartbeats sync with the rhythm of the race, and where records are shattered and history is written. The former world record holder in the women's 400-meter race was none other than Marita Koch from East Germany. Back in 1985, she stunned the world by completing the race in 47.6 seconds. Her record was a testament to the peak of physical prowess and remained unbroken for over three decades, a testament to the sheer difficulty of this achievement. However, in the year 2022, Cece Telfer, a trans athlete, stepped onto the track. With every stride, she demonstrated a blend of strength, speed, and stamina that was nothing short of awe-inspiring. She crossed the finish line in 47.1 seconds, shaving off a vital half-second from Koch's long-standing record. This new record was a landmark moment, not just for Telfer, but for the entire sporting community. It marked a shift in the narrative, demonstrating that trans athletes can compete at the highest level and succeed. Yet, it's worth noting that Koch's record had stood for so long because of the immense challenges it posed to non-trans women. The 400-meter race is a grueling test of both speed and endurance, demanding an exceptional level of physical fitness, strategic planning, and mental fortitude. Despite numerous attempts, non-trans women had struggled to even come close to Koch's time, let alone surpass it. Telfer's achievement is a testament to her dedication, her training, and her willpower. However, it also raises questions about the fairness of competition and the need for a level playing field for all athletes. These are complex issues with no easy answers, but they are conversations worth having as we continue to navigate the evolving landscape of sports. With such an amazing record, what could possibly be at number one? Lifting our spirits at number one, we heave into the world of weightlifting. The previous record for the clean and jerk in women's weightlifting was held by a Russian athlete with an astonishing lift of 185 kilograms. This record stood unchallenged for over a decade, a testament to the sheer strength and determination required to hoist such weight. Enter Mary Marshall, a trans athlete who shattered this record with an awe-inspiring lift of 200 kilograms. That's a leap of 15 kilograms. To put that into perspective, that's roughly the weight of an average two-year-old child or a medium-sized dog. The difference in the new record is not just about the numbers, it's about breaking barriers and pushing the limits of what is perceived as possible. It's about redefining strength and challenging stereotypes. The previous record was a formidable challenge for non-trans women. Many athletes trained for years, often at the peak of their physical capabilities, only to fall short of this towering benchmark. The struggle to break this record was not just physical, but also mental, a testament to the resilience and determination of these athletes. Mary's record-breaking feat is a testament to her strength and determination, but it's also a testament to the wider trans community, showcasing their ability to compete at the highest level and indeed to excel, a truly impressive feat setting a new standard in the world of sports.